All right, ready for some blooper highlights? All right, here we go. Heading out mountain biking today to with my uh, buddies Jason and Alex. We're gonna be uh, riding out at uh, DTE Energy Trails in uh, Chelsea, Michigan. Uh, some of the best trails in the uh, Lower Peninsula here in Michigan, and uh, gonna record as much as we can. And there's a few good jumps on there and some fun stuff that hopefully we'll have some good video when we're all said and done maybe a crash or two <laughs> well, hopefully not but uh, you never know and uh, so I thought it'd be fun to uh, record this stuff and uh, and share it with everyone so uh, I'll uh, update uh, as we go probably wondering today where's uh, the hair and makeup why are you looking all boyish and uh, well simply because this is what I look like without my hair and makeup on and this is part of the reason why I identify as gender fluid and uh, non-binary as well this is just me some days I feel like dressing like this and especially in the hot summer months um, you know when I'm working out outside and, and uh, mountain biking going to the beach stuff like that Unfortunately, the wig just isn't really practical for me. It's super hot as it is, and adding the hair just honestly makes it unbearable. And then, uh, you know, some days I just don't feel like getting all dolled up, and I'm sure a lot of uh, a lot of you can relate. When I don't get dolled up, this is what I look like. Sometimes I just feel like presenting more masculine. Sometimes I don't. And sometimes it's just, you know, it's just a necessity. It just is, is what it is. I, you know, like to look a lot prettier and have a more feminine shape, but uh, this is this is what I have. And, this is what I look like. This is what my body is, even with the hormones and all the things I've done. You know, I still don't have hair, and because of my muscularity, I have to get red. It's more masculine. Some days that's fine with me. Um, just depends. And uh, part of the fluidity and you know being non-binary, and you know I still identify as trans. I still have a strong you know female gender identity, um, although that may not be apparent to everyone looking at me. But uh, but yeah, this is all just part of me day to day. It just is what it is. What's up, homies? Good, good. All the words on your shirt are on backwards and upside down. No, they won't be after I crash. <laughs> I have that shirt. It's like Dude, deep that shirt for me. Sweet. You read this, flip me back over. That's hilarious. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> All right, ready to shred. Whew. Let's hope I don't die in the first mile like last time. But oh, yeah, well, yeah, we won't be crushing it yeah. today. <laughs> Too much speed. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, there you go. Yeah.
Oh, 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 oh man, Woo! you are right. Yeah. <laughs> Just got knocked off its axis a little bit there. Okay, post ride report. <laughs> As everyone saw, we had a good time. Uh, a couple little epic spills in there. Shoulder and uh, left side of the body's not feeling so hot right now. Uh, Jack my left shoulder up pretty good. The rear delt's hurting right now. Probably slight dislocation or something. Nothing big. You know, scraped up. Bruises. Ribs are feeling a little bruised. Um, you know, tender a little bit, nothing, nothing major. But all in all, great day, a lot of fun, had a good time, got some good cardio in. You know, had a couple crashes, but at least we got them on film. <laughs> and the funny thing is, I've hit that jump a whole bunch of times. I've, I've, all, I've landed it every single time. That's the first time I've ever crashed on it. Got a little squirrely, got a little sideways, and uh, that happens. No biggie, all part of the fun, and uh, just a good time. Hope you guys had a good time too, and uh, let me know if you like it. If you do, I'll do more of them. And uh, all right, take care, everyone. Have a good day.